healthy aging, bocce ball, bowling, tennis, ping pong. These seniors know how to stay active and have fun in the process. It's the High Desert Fitness Challenge for Seniors. Presented by Desert Valley Medical Group and Summit Orthopedic Associates. Bocce ball, combine elements of shuffleboard and horseshoes with the mechanics of bowling. And you've got competition that draws, among others, former golfers who don't feel like chasing that little ball around the course. What is the bocce ball? The little small ball that you throw down first. And then whoever gets closest to the ball will receive the point. It's a game that you've got eight balls, four balls on each team. Then the little white ball is called the bocce ball. The object of the game is you roll the bocce ball down to the far end, and then in turn, each person takes one ball and tries to get the closest to the bocce ball. Not a fast game, mind you. It's always one score, whether one color or another. Only one team scores points each time the eight balls have been thrown, or bowled. The game goes to 12 points, and whoever gets 12 first wins the game. If the ball rolls the length of the course and strikes the back wall, it's picked up. I remember in the old days you can hit the backboard and all, but now you can't hear. 85-year-old El Roca is the senior member of these bocce ball teams competing in the Seniors Challenge at Sun City in Apple Valley. This is literally a game of inches. The order of who bowls next is determined by who is closer to the bocce ball. Strategy? It's uh, just being able to read the, uh, the course and figure out which way the balls are going to break. Because every court you go to, you've got a different role. The finals matched Raw Paz and Sal Mastriani against Jesse Yates and Dave McCauley. The title game was tied at nine. It was a tight game. We had a little lead to start the game and uh, ended up they caught up to us and then it was stress on both sides. <laughs> Medals awarded third place team member the 85 year old, Raw Paz, the former construction worker, the 81 year old retired heavy equipment operator, the outspoken former peace officer, and the young Turk. Will these bocce ball players look forward to participating in next year's fourth annual event? We will. We'll be here. God willing. Thanks, We're coming back next year. All right. <laughs> Tall and slender Will Baird won the seniors' ping pong competition, defeating Rich Norton in the finals. This is not your grandfather's ping pong, though. They shorten the game. Uh, you now play to 11, but you have to win three. Uh, to win the set of five, where before it was 21, you only had to win two games. So it's about the same. The challengers included Gary Winkle, Gary Null, Wayne Miller, Thank You Park, and Rich Norton. With medals awarded to third place finisher, Thank You Park, runner up, Rich Norton, and the champ. How'd he come to enter? Well, my friend said I should enter, and they showed me the entry blank, so I guess that's how I got started. Seniors tennis players accepted the challenge and competed at two Sun City sites. These seniors taking the court at the Mariposa location, Ed Kraus and Lawrence Davis teamed to win the championship, defeating Bob Engelk and Bobby McClellan in the finals. Uh, we worked together to communicate, and we made some changes in our game, and the changes in the game produced winning results. He's a solid player. He uh, knows how to play doubles, and he uh, gave me some helping pointers there, and we, we pulled it up. Uh, uh, the tennis tourney director brought a relic of his own uh, to the event. This is the Jack Kramer autograph, the most uh, popular selling racket. Sold over a million uh, models of this racket, and this one is actually autographed by Jack Kramer. <laughs> Jolly good, gentlemen. Oh. Bowling took the seniors indoors to Victor Bowl. Oh. Getting our 
uh, proceeds from this year's event that's going to take place all the way through the 27th of this month. John Ledger was the men's winner and Sherry Cooper had the top overall score. Well, I, it was a lot of fun. I would highly encourage everyone to come out and participate. We just had a great time. Joe Culebra was the big winner at Texas Hold'em on the campus of Victor Valley College. Fran Renzo won dominoes. Seniors also competed in the fishing derby on the BBC campus. At the awards ceremony, 75-year-old Jack Wright was named winner of the Healthy Aging Contest. He's a former national champion power lifter. As for Desert Valley Medical Group's participation in the Senior Challenge? Well, I think it's been an absolutely incredible event. We're very pleased to have been a sponsor and look forward to doing this again in the future. Two, one. Bob and Bob. Congratulations.